Hello everyone, today I'm bringing you a, well, it, it's kind of a video response. What it is, it's a pink cushion for Annie, who is Miss Ma Garden Grove 1, and this is take 2. Some of you may remember I made her a, like a pink cushion in a sugar bowl for her. her challenge last year and I sent it away but it still hasn't arrived so I've made Annie a new pin cushion and it's not exactly like the other one because I'm still hopeful the other one may arrive um, and if it does then she can have a complementing set rather than two identical pin cushions so what I've done is I've used this really really beautiful jug can you see it's got this lovely um, like lacy effect it's like vines around the top of it it's probably silver plated or something and it's got the handle here and um, it is a bit sort of poofy so it's a bit hard to see the actual um, jug but I'm sure you understand what a jug oh actually at the back you can see it a little bit better there okay um, and I've used the last oh yes I think it's the last I may have an inch or two left of this gorgeous gorgeous vintage lace here um, on this I used that also on the last one I covered the pin cushion with doilies on the last one and I did the same thing here um, using the center of this beautiful piece of old doily here. I love that. I think it's beautiful and I hope Annie likes it too. On this one, this one is another doily and there's the bottom of the doily. I've just sort of cinched it in and gathered it with this lovely vintage lace around here. A couple of little flowers. Now this time around I have actually, I've stitched that one on but I've glued these on. No tiny little pins holding the flowers in this time because I'm kind of curious whether it may have not made it through some one of the country's customs because there were a lot of pins in it. I don't know if that's true or not but you know I'm just I'm just trying to wonder why it didn't get there. Uh, this one only has two stick pins. The top one here is a really long hat pin and um, I like the way that looks and that was a one I've previously made before and this one here is a flower and it's only it's let me just There we go. It's a smaller one there. Can you see? And this little charm. Now this little charm was meant to actually go in the package with the last one. I forgot to show it, I think. Um, and I forgot to put it in. So I'm making sure that I've put it on here with this one because I don't have very many tea party type things. But I did have a spoon and I did have a fork and I think there's a little coffee, little coffee pot there and... I think a cup and saucer if I recall yes oh yeah a little cup and saucer and a tiny little bell um, so I've put those on there as well and just some pearl and sari silk on the handle part a flower there I've just made out of some fabric those little threads are actually coming from the sari silk some vintage flowers here and lovely vintage laces on the top there as well. So that's take two of my pincushion for Annie, who is Miss Garden Grove 1 on YouTube. I'm so sorry the first one hasn't got there, Annie. I really am. I have no idea why. I did not put tracking on it, though, so I can't... I have put, like, a... Um, oh, what is it called? Inquiry into the post office in the hopes that they can find it um, but because there wasn't tracking on it I, you know I don't know whether they can or not they said they might be able to you would think in this day and age they would because everything has a number doesn't it um, but this one definitely is getting some paid tracking on it when I send it on Thursday so I hope you like it Annie and I will be sending this to you um, and let's just keep our fingers crossed that it makes it there okay. Okay, thank you everybody for watching and take care. Bye-bye.